ready to go to the airport. Lies, but anyway. Good morning. Good morning, good people. So we have to go pick up Stanley's mom. Lord, this highway. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. God damn it. We got a little a whole lot of bumps here, man. She just that's how you know you hit the city limits. <laughs> in y'all city. In y'all city, are the, uh, they always working on the inter interstate? Oh, look. The interstate is never ever right. You always working on it. I've I've pretty much been traveling this highway since my first fiance. We've been married 20 years. I was engaged probably, what, about six years before you? Right. So we'll just say 26 years. Yeah, just, just, just <laughs> keep working. Hey, I ain't mad at it. It's job security, man. You know, you got It's a lot of job security. Yeah. But like we said, we're on our way to um, meet Stanley's brother at the halfway point. Thank God that we don't have to go all the way down there yeah. to get his mom so that we can begin the festivities in my T.I. voice hey man, what this week. What y'all think about the porch, man? came out good with that old Thompson water seal. Yeah. And that's autumn brown solid. It only took a couple of hours to do it yesterday. It did. Well, it took us a couple of hours after we got started. Yeah. yeah. What's that? It's in my coffee. Ew! Ew! Wait a minute, y'all. I don't know what the... I don't know what the hell that was if it's in my coffee, man, but it but it took me back <laughs> when I we was in the office at work. One day I was coming to work, right, and I got out of my car and I had for some reason I decided to spit my coffee out. No, I felt something in my mouth with my coffee, just like that. And I spit my coffee out. And so when I looked on the ground, I saw like these little worms going like this in my coffee. And I was like, wait, don't tell me that this worm was in my freaking mouth. But the it's worm on in the coffee. The worm was on the ground. And I <laughs> but he had a complex about but, it for yeah. like a month. Yeah, so anytime I'm drinking coffee and I feel something in my mouth, yeah, it just it take me back out. Yeah, I got issues, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, I talk cash money skit about this being like a 26 year project, but I'm gonna give them their flowers. This has always been a two lane highway. We now have three at this point, <laughs> going almost all the way down to Virginia Beach. So, so we we be complaining about it, but they have made some progress. <laughs> Twenty six years, like the Bible said, don't count me out. Don't man, count me out. That's darn near mortgage, man. You darn right. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's the long term they had uh -huh. on the, on the workers. Dang, y'all know what we like. I thought it was a three done. <laughs> I thought it was three lanes a little further down. But it, no. It took them, it took them 30 years to do that spot right that back far, there. Yeah. Which was literally probably about, what, two miles? Yeah, so we gotta wait for another 30 for this part. <laughs> Dang, on our All right, family, me and the queen have met my brother and picked up my mom. We're gonna been back home. We have been out on the porch having a good time and you probably heard that it's getting ready to rain out here now but i wanted to show y'all something real cool that we had actually um the queen had found online well actually she found it on TikTok. this bad boy right here to help with you know the fly problem you want to sit outside and enjoy yourself and the flies i want you to be great especially if you got food at a cookout or you just want to eat outside period but check out this fly this fly trap man that can help out with this check out this thing and we just set this up maybe about an hour ago Look at that. All them day gonna fly. Look at that. And basically all you do is you fill it up with water to the line that's on the bottle, set the, set the little repellent down inside the water, and they say the two to five hours is supposed to put a, uh, a fragrance or some kind of odor will attract them. But I, I think when I put it down, probably about five or 10 minutes, a bunch of flies will find it because it said that the flies will find it quick. And as you can see, they're inside and on the outside. So yeah, I'll leave the Home Depot link down in the description if you want to order one and pick it up at the store or possibly get one shipped to your house. All right, y'all, I'm back in the house now with the queen. She in here burning. I'm in here, came back here so I can help her out. But I forgot to mention about the fly trap. 
that you gotta put that away from the house. So you're gonna see it on on the direction of you side. Right, he read it because it would have been right up underneath him. Yeah, so you gotta put it away from the house to draw the flies away from you. And it works. Oh, it yeah. works. <laughs> yeah. But uh, we in here. We was we was thinking about cooking out. But it's hot. Yeah. So uh, not only is it hot, it's very humid. We got some beans going back here in this pot right here. We got some corn going. Over here we got a burger. Cooking the slow, cause them things onions. Yeah, got that over here working. So, uh, like we told y'all, we on us and the, and the moms is going out of town. Uh, we not actually leaving until the middle of the week. So we basically gonna be on chill mode. So we just doing a little something just to have something to do until those two days, because we still gotta work on Monday. Yeah, we still gotta work on Monday and Tuesday, but yeah. Yeah, it's thundering outside. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, did y'all hear that thunder when I was outside talking to y'all? Yeah, they go to lights. What's up, fam? Guess where we are? We on vacation again. <laughs> <laughs> of course. And they got the queen right there. Boom. So, Ashley, I think we had mentioned to y'all uh, probably a few weeks ago or a month ago that this month we were taking our moms on vacation. For the summer so we actually in williamsburg right now at the diamonds resort that we know where the diamonds are sure the diamond resort green springs diamond resort uh that we always come to anyway because we love this resort but uh we got here on yesterday and, and storm as soon as we got here storm soon we got here so now all of us is getting dressed and we get ready to head on down to the pool and i gotta get strapped up because my strap keep popping y'all huh so yeah, we're going down here and enjoy this this uh pool water and I'm just so glad we don't gotta go back to work until next Thursday. Can we get a hallelujah? Yeah, let the church say amen. <laughs> so alright y'all, we're gonna get this pool up real quick. You my best friend didn't care about those good on the weekends. I'll be in fools, drifting the deep space. So brave and so stupid. Just like the movies. All right, good folks, we back from the pool. We have a great time, but we are here just giving the Lord praise because my mama is terrified of water. And she actually got in the pool for the first time today. So that's a win right there. Like, so if nothing else happens on this vacation, mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. Because every time she hangs out with us, we try to get her to conquer at least one more of her fears. One more of her fears, because you know it's baby steps. So yeah, so we uh we definitely on 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 a high right now yeah, because so of that. Of yeah, real proud of her. So uh, down in the comments, go ahead and tell her congratulations, and I'll show her the comments so y'all can congratulate her too. Check this out, family. What? The nanny here riding mama's uh, rental Mercedes Benz scooter. Look, so, look, look. look. <laughs> what are for that? Uh, we was actually trying to rent a, a freaking golf cart about an hour ago. I called up the front desk, but they said that the golf cart is only for maintenance and housekeeping. But we have seen like some regular folk walking around here uh, with golf carts, but we thinking that they rented them from somewhere else or maybe brought it from home, but we was hoping because I was going to take them riding around around the goddamn property. Matter of fact, let me go show you where, where I was planning on riding at. So this is our patio on the back right here. So I came out of there and right over here is where you can play golf. But they also have a concrete pathway that you can ride golf carts. So I was planning on riding out here but they say they don't do the rentals and so i was over here earlier I'm take y'all over here they got a little spot over here when you can grill out with the family as you can see all every one of the the rooms either have a patio or a patio with the fencing so you can chill out Or right over here. <clears throat> got a little picnic table. Got a little portable grill and then the, the grill in the ground. So we started to come over here and grill out, but I, I doubt it very seriously, but I just wanted to bring y'all over here and show y'all. But yeah, I wanted to 
for us to ride and chill on this pathway right here, man. So uh, maybe the next time that we uh, come down here, we'll just maybe check out one of the companies and see if we can get them to rent us a golf cart. And then we can just ride around on the property, man, have some fun. Alright, so mom, mama said she get ready to fry some chicken. She had it soaking. She got some what chicken and steak, don't she? Poke chop. Oh well, chicken and poke chop that she had soaking Not yesterday. Poke, poke, poke. poke chop. Alright, mom, you gotta let the family know how you season your chicken. Well, today I just only had salt and pepper on it. Well, how you normally season if you don't got only salt and pepper? Uh, some uh, uh chicken chicken spice, stuff like that. Like what? Like like this? Like sazon? Yeah. Okay. And just chop it up and that's it. Okay. Just put some garlic powder on it. You wanna put your garlic powder on your chicken? Mm -hmm. Hey, Ma, how you season your chicken? Um, salt, pepper, um, I think pork chicken. Okay. All right now. Hey, y'all keep it simple and cute. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. What you over here doing? Watching this? I just washing a few of them, you know, make it look like I ain't ran here not doing nothing. So you washing dishes, mama frying chicken, and I don't know what, what, what mama doing. She over there trying to find the sugar dad. Uh -huh. oh. You over there texting your man? <laughs> 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 trying to get you a step down. <laughs> Mind your, look, mama yeah. told her, mind his business. No, Natalie do. <laughs> <laughs> look, she had that baby suit on for a reason, like. Uh-huh. Yeah, nice, that nice baby suit on. Yeah, it really look real good on. Uh-huh. Hey, hey. What? Yeah. That ain't got baby suit. Oh, no. <laughs> Not this time with them bad boys. Huh. But never mind. <laughs> I said, never mind. So she got, she got, she got you out there. She, she, she showed up, got you, got you out your comfort zone. <laughs> hey, that's the one you have to pick out when we was in. Who was that? We were getting ready to go on the cruise in yeah. nineteen. That's right. Yeah. So she had that baby suit for two years. Mm. And, I but, took, and my boyfriend I said, I'm not gonna wear it unless I got something I've covered up. Cause you know she's scared off of the store that she found something. I said, here you go. <laughs> mm -mm. I said, here you go, some nice pants. Yep, it's all right with the pants. Uh -huh. And I said, go on with these swim pants right here. Mm -hmm. I told I told the queen, I said, maybe maybe you in the wrong profession. Maybe you need to get in a profession to help people get past their fears. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, she be doing it, yeah, she. Mm -hmm. So you done got mama to do a whole lot of stuff she ain't never done before. Mama? Yeah, she did. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> yep. yep. I'm like that though. I, I'll get you. I'm not gonna let you. I'm not gonna let your mind tell you you can't do something. Right. Because life is to be lived. Yeah. Cause we were talk. We were just talking about how every time you think about something, your mind instantly takes you to the worst case scenario. So you be like, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and fly to Florida, and your mind gonna tell you that the plane is gonna gonna crash in the sky, it's gonna fall in the sky, yeah, or y'all you gonna end up on the Hudson. <laughs> In New York, like that happened years ago, so your mind is telling you all that you stuff. Don't, don't need a hijacking for that. Yeah, the, or, or the plane will get hijacked like, like on 9-11. 9-11. <laughs> that won't get hijacked. Yep. Much about it. Don't get hijacked. And even though, even though none of that stuff haven't happened for years, <laughs> it's gonna, it's gonna happen but your mind, your mind tell you it's going to happen on your flight. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then yeah. I say, and you know what? What if, what if it happens? Yeah. Either you're going to make it through it or you're not. I mean, there is no in-between with this. So... Well, we've learned the only way that you can deal with fear is you have to do whatever you want to do. You have to do it scared. You have to confront it. And then once you confront it and be like, I don't understand. Then you'll be like, I don't understand why I was afraid of that so much. Because your mind was trying to talk you out of it. All right, part of the chicken is done. The rice back in. Say everything want to And got some screen mange, man. Just a little bit. Yeah. Chilling with that gasoline, man. I'm mad that this one can of screen beans is over here just, just stretching. <laughs> just that one can? Yes. I don't know why I just one can. Lord family, we just came back from the pool for the second time. Mama said she wanted to go back to the network. But Nancy's mama said she wanted to go back to the pool. So we was like, well, we'll go down with you. So we went down there. We soaked in the water, talked, had a good time. But shouts out yeah. to... Uh, 
to the sister that walked up to us and said she recognized us from our channel from the Murder Beach video. So appreciate you, sister, coming up and introducing yourself. Her family oh, is beautiful. Yeah, and your family is beautiful. I, man, that, that hat that your little boy had on was everything. Matter of fact, I need to find me one of them hats. But yeah, shout out to y'all. Thank you so much for coming up. And uh, I hope your Williamsburg vacation was real, real, real good. Of course, we having a good time. But yeah, it was great meeting you. And Lynette feeling so good. She's still in her baby suit. I'm not. I got my mom in the shower. I got my mom in the shower, so I refuse to. I can't sit down because I'm wet. So when she gets out of the shower, I'm jumping in. Hello, y'all. We done in, eat, reached the end of the road of this guy doing trip. This is the last night, so we up in here packing, as you can see. But. Today we had a fun pack day. We went to the to the outlet malls that we took y'all the last time we was here. So we went over there with our moms and we, we, we got some ice cream. We done ate some pizza. We've eaten a lot. <laughs> yeah, we done ate a whole lot of stuff. So we're gonna get all this stuff in here packed up, go to bed, get up in the morning, Do and head straight on back down to the RVA. And on that note, straight from the VA. The dirty, dirty side. Two up, two down, holla! Yeah.